Alrighty, everybody. It's me. Yep. Sorry, being loud. It's Monday. Um, I got sun glaring in on my camera. Hopefully, it moves by the time I turn this way. It's 8:05 in the morning. Hey, look at me. See me. 38 degrees outside. Hence the nice warm hat and the jacket. Um, yeah, it's uh, December 18th, 2017, almost the end of the year. This year has flown by, and I completely blew my goal of 52 videos this year. Uh, sorry, I only got maybe half of that, which is probably why I'm not a huge channel. So, um, this is what we're going to do today. Um, I got a friend who is up in the Great White North right now, knee deep in snow, and he's feeling a little left out of digging and stuff. And one of the things he likes to see me dig are at one of the parks where I get all those ball bearings. So, Will Hornbuckle, today's hunt is for you. I hope you enjoy this. Um, I'm going to see how many more uh, ball bearings I can get today. I think my record out of that park was 11 or 12. And they're like inch or two, two and a quarter inch ball bearings. They're huge. They used to be on a, uh, a, a tractor that they used here back in the turn of the century. And there's like a whole bunch of them out there. So we'll see how many I can dig just for you, Will. Um, I'm not really looking for anything special. This is just a hunt to find some ball bearings for my buddy, Will Hornbuckle. So, Will, this hunt's for you. All right, I'm going to concentrate on driving and uh, get us to where we need to go. All right, I'll see you at the park. Well, I'm here. And nobody else is. I think I'm going to... Get out of my shoes, put on my boots, and we're going to walk all the way out to the spot where Mr. Will Hornbuckle's ball bearings are at. Let's go harvest a couple ball bearings for him. What do you think? I think it's a good idea. Yeah, I haven't been out since last week, so, or the week before last. Last week I spent a lot of time sleeping, but I feel better. Um, oh, someone pulled in behind me. Who's this person? Who knows? But anyhow. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, uh, yeah, let's see what we can do. Okay. Here's my third hole. It's a Jefferson Nickel 1965. Second hole was a, an iron bolt. Okay, well, it took about five holes, six holes. I got your ball bearing. <laughs> there you go, man. I'm going to turn loop around and go back the other way. See if I get another one. Ball bearing number two. That one's a little bit better shape. Ooh. All right. Well, that was a pretty uneventful but fun hunt. Um, it was just good to get out. That was a boom. Um, so I dug some stuff. Let's look at the stuff. Okay. Um, big chunk of iron. Even bigger chunk of iron. Oh, I've got a bunch of lag bolts. A whole bunch of lag bolts. And just look like rusty chicken bones. There's a square nut. Hard to tell, but it's a square nut. We got the uh, little Dos Equis. Unknown brand. Pull tab. We got two, four, 14 pennies, well, 14 cents, two nickels, 65, and a more modern one. Uh, set of iPhone headphones. I'm just going to leave them on the park bench here. I don't want them. Someone lost them. There's one of uh, the Will Hornbuckle Memorial ball bearings. And there's the first one I dug. There you go, Will. Found you two ball bearings. All right. Today's hunt was just meant for fun. I wasn't really expecting to find anything great. I just wanted to get out and dig. And 
sometimes that's all we have to do is just get out and dig. Um, you know, work gets to you, or if you're not working, retirement gets to you, and you just need to go out and do something. And like for me, I was at work all night, and I really just need to get out and dig. And it was good. Eh, targets weren't that good. My machine was very chattery over here for some reason, but I think it needs a, a recharge. Um, I'll take it in, clean it up, and put it on the charger. But uh, no, uh, today's equipment, by the way, using my Deus with my um, Quest um, headphones for the WS4 module, using my Relic Elite pouch, White's TRX bid pointer, and Leshy hand digger. Uh, one of these days I should actually just take my Samson out and actually use it in a park. I think I'm okay enough with my plugs to do that. I don't think I'll use the grave digger in a park. That might scare people. So, anyways, I want to thank you all for joining me. Uh, it's a typical metal detecting hunt. It's not always silver and gold. Sometimes it's big old ball bearings. Y'all have a great day. Good luck out there. Happy hunting. Stay safe. And as always, bye for now. So, that was my hunt. Um, yeah, I didn't film every single find. Um, I'm pretty sure you didn't want to see every single one of those chunks of iron coming out of the soil. But like I said, today's hunt was to find a couple of ball bearings for my good friend, Will Hornbuck. See, he's trapped up there in the big ice and snow that's going on right now, and he can't get out and dig. He had mentioned that he'd have to watch everybody else in these areas that you can still dig in the wintertime. Well, for me, it's California. Yeah, it's cold, but it's not snowy. There was ice in the grass. Those headphones actually were in ice. So, it's still cold. But, I mean, not cold enough where I don't can't wear shorts. Yeah, I still wear shorts. Um... But no, it was good to get out and dig. It's a beautiful day today. Um, yeah, it was about a, about an hour and a half hunt, walking around. Get a little exercise in. Now I'm going to go home and relax, go to sleep. Well, i got to throw some clothes in the laundry and, well, go to work tonight. So, anyways, those are my thoughts for today. Uh... So everybody be kind out there. The world needs more kindness. All right? So, bye again.